I'm grateful for all the awesome comments you all leave on my videos when I take on a challenge. So today, I'm putting your ideas to the test. Let's see what happens. First up is from the video where I took down a Hinox using a bunch of goofy builds. There was a repeating idea that was in the comments, so I figured I'd give it a shot. The idea essentially is to give the sled that launches the bombs a more generous shaft. So I did just that. I wanted to approach this making it a little bit overkill at first, but it broke and it kept breaking until eventually I was left with one tree and one stabilizer, but that's all right. Let's see how it works. Okay. Wow. Yeah. Uh, this thing worked way better than my original design. It got the Hinox below half health. That was a great idea. Next up is from when I decided to try out this game's boat minigame. An idea was floated towards me that I should try using an actual boat. Yeah, uh, looking back, that does seem rather logical. So I, uh, I set off to go find a boat because they are apparently on the coast nearby. And as you see, I flew all the way to here along the coast while looking for a boat until I realized I must have went the wrong way. After flying an absurd amount in the other direction, I became impatient due to the lack of boats along the coast that were not destroyed. So instead, we are trying this idea. Try a flying machine that trails a pole in the water. I like this idea. Why have a boat when you can fly? That's good thinking. And to my surprise, my first idea wasn't allowed. But that's okay. I gave it a small redesign. Yeah, uh, this too was rejected. Only feeling a bit distraught, I went with a third redesign. Okay, I'm starting to get the idea that the boat people don't like flying devices. But I was determined to get this. And if this next design doesn't do it, I got a feeling nothing will work. So I got the wing all set up and ready. And just like that, we have a design that is approved. Let's see how it does. Wow. Okay. Turns out the best boat you can use doesn't even touch the water half the time. Instead, it flies. If you're enjoying this video so far, leave me a thumbs up and consider subscribing. Up next, we will be spending some time at everyone's favorite bell. And the idea that led us here is to use the two spring approach that I've used before in previous videos, but put a bomb on top. I got the device built, lined it up real nice and pretty. Let's see what it does. Well, we ended up scoring a 215, so that's not bad. But I don't understand why the bomb doesn't go off. Seems like how we had it set up should have done the trick. Next up is an idea from Thod that takes us back to the Hinox. And wow, uh, yeah, you were fairly descriptive. 
So I constructed exactly what you put. And I set it in place instead of using the rocket because I couldn't get it to work. It destroyed the Hinox before it could even fully drain my battery. That is very impressive. Thank you all for the wonderful ideas. If you leave more in the comments, I might just make them happen in an upcoming video. Until then, I'll catch you next time.